So it turns out that CNN, captain of the fake news, they saw that Fox News has gone woke, firing a great patriot like Dr. Carlson. So they said, well, we're going to go even more aggressive. We're going to fire Don Lemon. We call him a citrus fruit because he's lemon. It's called it. No, excuse me. No, you're actually homophobic. You're actually. No, actually. Uh, no, not at all. In fact, not at all. Uh, I actually watch many films featuring two men having sex with a woman. Very not homophobic, okay? Very prophobic or pro, pro homo is, I think, what we would say. Very strong in that department. And so you're actually racist and homophobic. So how about that? Shut up. The point is, Don Lemon, probably the dumbest person in all of media, uh, one of the worst journalists, one of the worst people, by the way. And he was a total sexist. Did you notice that? Did you notice that he was totally sexist? It was almost like he'd... You know, I think he hated women so much he didn't even have sex with them. So how about that? And they call me misogynist just for grabbing them. Well, Don Lemon was mean to them. Which is actually, if you look at your laws and your other such things, I think being mean to women is even worse than grabbing them when they don't want it and... Uh, talking about them when they're your daughter in a sexual manner. So I think CNN, they wanted to compete with Fox. Now we call them woke news for getting rid of Tucker. They wanted to compete with Fox. And in fact, they've proven that they are awful. In, in a weird way, they're, they're almost racist for firing, uh, well, a dumb black, but a black nonetheless. And, uh, you know, they'll probably hire Jack Black soon. Who's not bad. Not, you know, that's probably my favorite African American, Jack Black. But can't say that now. Can't say that no. We gotta, we gotta be PC. So CNN, total disgrace. And I bet your Newsmax is gonna hire Don Lemon or, or maybe Tucker, and Chris Cuomo will still be all on at whatever the hell channel he's on. So we'll see what happens.